Good morning and welcome to a new daily vlog. Last daily vlog of the week. I'm just about to get some cornflakes for breakfast. I'm gonna pour one into there. Oh, only one handed. Got too many. <laughs> oh well, they're not that many there. I think I'm going to take this box because there's quite a few left. I'm going to take that box back to Grimsby with me. And then I can have them um, at my grandma's next week. Got some ironing to do as well at some point today. It's the Lionettes match later on as well. So I'm going to have my breakfast. My mum wants some Bongella, so I'm going to get her that. And then I'll head to the hospital a little bit later on. I haven't see my mum, but yeah, I need to get some ironing done. I haven't got that much ironing to do, but I do need to get it done. Um, but first, I'm going to have my breakfast, and then go to the shop and get my mum's Bongella. So I've just had my cornflakes. Just a normal breakfast, really. It's currently 38 minutes past 12, so i have my breakfast a bit late again. Um, I'm going to head to the shop now. Really get my mum this bonjello that she wants, um, and then I'm going to try and leave here for about 1:45, 1:50 sort of time. It's not going to take me that long to drive around to the hospital, but I want to try and get in for two o'clock, and I'm be in there for two. Come out at about four, and then I've got plenty of time to do what I need to do around the house, like my iron in and other little bits that I need to get done around here before I start travelling back to Grimsby tomorrow so um yeah anyway um I'm gonna go to the shop get this Bongella for my mum so I just got back from the shop and I can't find Bongella anywhere been to the co-op I looked at like their um pain relief section there went to the Tesco's looked at their pain relief and I've been to the chemist as well and nothing in either. Uh, I'm going to Google it and see why I can't find Bongella. Um, then hopefully he'll probably go and try another chemist or something. So, um, yeah. Anyway, I'm going to go and try and find if I can find some anywhere. And then I'm going to go and visit my mum. So I've just got home from visiting my mum. It's now 34 minutes past four. Um, she was alright today, really. Um, I couldn't get the Bongella, and then she didn't even ask about it when I got there. So, um, yeah, and I found out, I googled it, and apparently it's been taken off the shelves for some, because in fear that people are giving too much to um, babies and stuff. But, um, yeah, don't really know why it's been around for years, and I think it's really happened with it and yeah you can apparently get it from chemists but by the time I got to the chemist and then come back it wasn't on the shelf I'm guessing it's behind the counter or something at the chemist but um, I just wanted to get in to see my mum so that I could have as much time as I can possibly with her before my parking runs out and get in there I get a reasonable time so I can get back here at a reasonable time as well so um, it's been alright today um, like I said, it's just gone half four, so um, it's quite a nice reasonable time to get back, get a few bits done here, and then be ready for eight o'clock when the Lionesses football match starts. I don't know if it's like the stats and all they're talking about it that starts at eight and then the game starts at eight thirty, but um, I think that's what it's going to be. I think it's going to be all the all the um, talk and all the round raveling of each team and everything before the kick off at half past eight but we'll soon find out when the game starts um, but yeah I think I'm going to get something to eat and then get on with a few bits that I need to do like my iron and I still need to do that so yeah I think I'm going to get a burger I think I've got a burger in the fridge that I need to have before heading back up to Wimmersby tomorrow so um yeah I'm gonna get a spot of lunch so it's now 
eight minutes past seven. This boom has been on a while to turn this off. And it is actually quite toasty in the living room right now. And I don't really want the boiler on all night because the light is going to be too warm. But we do need some light in here. And I do need to pop out and get that bin in because the bin um, got emptied this morning. And the Lioness's match starts soon. I've got a glass of Coca Cola here. That's good. And then I've got a couple of bottles of um, Copperberg cider here. This is strawberry and lime. So I've got a couple of bottles of that for watching the match. I've also got a 20 piece um, snack pack. It's got like pork pie, sausage rolls, uh, sausage rolls, scotch eggs, cocktail sausages, and some like chicken things, bacon and cheese, straws. So I've got them to have while watching the match. I've got some breadsticks, I've got some hummus, I am A-OK -okay for snacks, um, got a few sweets, um, so that's all good. So yeah, it's Emmerdale on at the minute, and then um, the match, well it doesn't start, I don't know what time it starts, I'm just thinking, the programme starts at 8 o'clock, so it's now 10 minutes past 7, so it's still a little while before the match starts but what I'm going to do I think is um, get my laptop set up so it's getting booted up and everything so it doesn't crash on me when I'm trying to edit then I'll let you know what I'm thinking at half time and then I'll let you know the full thing what I think to the match at the end and then I'll edit later on so um, yeah I'll let you know I'll see you at half time. So we've had a good first half. Um, Alicia Russo scored the first goal. Um, we've got one, we're now one, one nil ahead. Uh, within the first few minutes, Alicia Russo was fouled and went down for quite a while, and then she got referees hold and told the um, oh the um, I don't know what you call them first aiders or the like the paramedics team paramedics the referee told them to, that they had to take it to the side of the pitch so they could carry on the game and then they sort of taped up a leg and she came back and um, scored the goal a bit later on so yeah we're not one nil ahead the game's like really going well we've had a good possession of the ball and everything like that so yeah we've got good possession of the ball in the first half um, I just hope we get a few more goals in the second half. It's looking really good though. Um, they've had some chances, but luckily they haven't managed to get one in one. They had like a chance when they were up, but they were offside. So that didn't count and it didn't go in or anything. But it was the flag went up before they had a chance to shoot. And now we'll play sort of like this held back because they sort of played the offside. So, yeah, it's going good. We're 1-0 up. Let's see what happens in the second half. Well, a little bit of a disappointing end to that match. Um, it wasn't a loss or anything. It was a draw. 1-1. They managed to get one back. Uh, which was a bit disappointing. It would have been nice to get the win. And um, Beth Mead came on. Um, Chloe Kelly came on. They gave it some really good, um, made some really good chances, but unfortunately, nothing um, came of it and nothing got scored other than that one goal in the first half and then one goal from Sweden in the second half. Uh, but there were some good attempts to get like another one for the Lionesses, but yeah, they just weren't, weren't really there. Uh, it was good chances. Um, had a good chance. Lauren Hemp had quite a good chance. 
I think Chloe Kelly had a couple of chances, but yeah, it was good. Um, I think the next match now is on Tuesday, I think. I think it's Republic of Ireland on Tuesday for the next game. So I'll be in um, Grimsby for that, so I won't be vlogging that match. But um, yeah, a little bit of a disappointing that we didn't get a win and it was a draw, but it was still a good game to watch. And it was still a good um, thing, but hopefully the Lionesses will get through to um, the Euros and they'll be in the Euros um, next summer. I don't think it's this summer, it's Euros 2025. But yeah, hopefully they'll get through, they'll be in the tournament. But they've got a couple of matches to get in through these playoffs. But yeah, anyway, it's getting on, on a bit now. It's now, let me see what the time is. Nearly 10 o'clock, 9.56. So I'm going to end this vlog here and for the week as well. Um, I'm going to be in Grimsby again next week, so it's not really the best place to be vlogging until I've actually got more there. Because at some point we'll be moving there. And then I'll be able to vlog better when I've got an actual proper place to vlog from, sort of thing, like a proper base, like I have here. Um, but yeah, other than that, I'm just going to get on with the editing of this vlog now, and um, yes, I'm going to end today's vlog here, so don't forget, if you like the vlog, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, leave a, subscribe, leave a comment, and click the bell, so you always get notified when I upload new videos, and I'll see you in about a week, so don't forget, if you dream it, believe it achieve it. Good night.